Welcome back everyone to our Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough. Um, I think last time we left off we just finished the kind of bar fight mission um, with uh, Javier and Charles. Um, and then at the end of it you run into Trelawney after the fight's over and um, he kind of says he has information about the whereabouts of um, Sean. So that's kind of where we're at, not too far into it. So. Um, yeah, we'll keep going as soon as this loads for us. Um, don't totally know what I'm planning on doing on this one. I was hoping to be able to do um, Jose's mission where you go hunting with him just because I, I want to have access to be able to start you know, getting whatever horses I want to because uh, like I said in the previous episodes I kind of already have in my mind what horses I want to get just from some of my experience from um, my kind of half playthrough I did and then also um, playing online I kind of have a, a favorite horse that I want to kind of tame in in this story as well but so we'll see if that's available if that's available that's what we'll do if not we'll uh we'll do something else I actually think we finished the last episode off by doing that bar fight but also um we had just started the gunslinger stranger mission so I should if I look in my satchel I should have the yeah the um Gunslinger pictures and on the back. Oh, let me do that. On the back, it should have their kind of whereabouts. But I think in order to get their location on the map, I have to look at the back. So, yeah. Well, freak. I guess I can just hit next. Let's just put them all on the map. I don't know if I'll do any of them right now, but let's just at least put them on the map. Also, I just have to go back to Satchel. I think Flacco is one of my favorites. Um, it says that he raids into Annisburg and Valentine and Strawberry. Um, I wonder if you can actually ever encounter him there, or if that's just kind of just kind of story filler stuff. That'd be cool if you could actually kind of run into him in those areas instead of up at his hideout. This guy's actually really close to where we are right now. Um, and his little... Th oh, gosh dang it. Still getting used to this commentating and trying to play at the same time thing. But Cool, now they're on the map, so we can do those when we want to, but... Let me look to see what missions I have available. So there should be... That's like Flacco's up there. Um, Emmett Granger's pretty close to camp. Reverend Swanson, that's kind of where you learn to play poker, which I don't even know how to play poker in real life, so that sucks. But it looks like I have an H, so we've got Jose's mission. So let's just, let's go do that. It's one of my favorite missions. I just remember it's just so cinematic and, and cool. Yes, I want to auto save. Right, yeah! I gotta keep reminding myself to talk a little bit louder. Not only because I'm just kind of soft spoken, but just because of I'm recording using my headset, so I know the audio is not the greatest. So I just gotta keep reminding myself to talk loud and clear. My horse is filthy, uh, but I don't. I don't think I get the brush until we go visit the stable during this mission. it or no? Okay. 
That's so dirty. Okay, Holy cow. Yep. All right. I thought I heard a turkey. There we go. So that's the horse that I was talking about um, last episode or the episode before that. This is the Raven Black Shire. That's kind of a like a unique horse. So this is the only time you can encounter it or get it or see it. That yeah, I mean we'll see right here as I start this mission. But Jose is gonna want us to take it to the stables. So Jose, let's do it. You want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no boat to see. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you can buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay, but I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses, and the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. Just get this. Just Such a big horse. This is gonna be fun. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel, if I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. He's huge. Big All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> Maybe I'm crazy, but I don't uh, know who Mac so is. Boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. Did it Mac? Hard on Lenny. Was that one of the people you that tell. Dutch you listed off when her. he was talking about the people that well, passed away? Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Oh, that serial killer thing's not even there yet. Interesting. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You find a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. Was he his horse? I know it's the. Get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. Um, I know Jose's horse just from again videos I watched and stuff. I know that his horse is a like a silver turcoman or something, Stables but it looks ahead. like the scrawny nag from online, and I I can't get that out of my mind. But All right. Go sell so that big brute. I'm not gonna sell him. I'm gonna I stable him just because I I really okay. like his horse. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. 
Meet you back here in a bit. I, th I think that they give me the brush, or I have to buy it here. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But, your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Well, yeah. I don't want to sell Take a him. look. I should be able to just hit Y, yeah, and stable. Sell him for 65? Yeah, no thanks. I'll just keep him. This is the thing that sucks, is I... I mean, I I don't plan on keeping this horse very long, and, and neither of these are really horses that I would necessarily want, but I just don't want to... I don't want to buy this stupid Morgan horse. But I have to. It's kind of a joke with my family, but, but I hope not them to eat we call our animals Kathy. So I'm just gonna name it Kathy. I wonder if it'll let me. It's probably in provisions, right? Provisions, tonics. Yeah, I, th I think he actually just gives me the. Um, Nah, I'll just, uh, oh, actually, these, uh, help with drain and stuff, so. Might as well. Just put those on there, and all right, partner. Call it good. You got yourself a deal, and a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Alright, let's see. So, uh, here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. Alright, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Just like, I just bought a horse that's filthy. Oh. So choice. little. And then Jose makes fun How of it. Did you pay for that thing? Not that much. Okay, well, with some good care, you should be able to make something of it. We'll see how long we keep, keep uh, Kathy here for her, but. Um, Are you going to mount that new horse of yours or not? Ah, right, shut up, let's Jose. Get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this Pretty time, sure we just, like, cut scene this ride. I don't think it makes me ride all the way up there with him. So I think it cut scenes the majority of it, and then John. I take over at the end. Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. <laughs> it's a boy and I he named it Kathy. Running. Oh no. Dutching you pretty much raised him. <laughs> I know. But it's tough. Oh. Has been for a while now. Well, whatever. <laughs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long, and you know it. Maybe, but please don't you put that right, to yeah, the there test. We go. This game is—it's hard to do just 30-minute episodes like I want to because. 
one mission like this takes okay. you know, 30 missions. This is going to be like a 100 part series, but you know, I love to make hour long episodes or, or longer, but um, I just know that you know most people don't want to sit down and watch a you know hour long episode of something, so I thought it's yes. better to just keep them at 30 minutes or so. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. I can't believe it. So I didn't even look. I just, I just assumed it was a girl. I should have looked though, but that's funny. We made it. Name's Kathy, and it's a boy. That's Sean. I'm gonna be heading back over to Great Plains. See about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him. So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but. If he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. I think maybe in the next episode what we'll do is head in that direction, but as we head in that direction... Maybe we should catch one to... Sure. We'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too... ...powerful on a small animal like that. You just ruin the meat. Well... Sorry, dude, I don't have much of a choice here. I have hunted rabbits before. Easy now, boy. Just skin this one, because I don't think it matters if I catch two. But anyway, what I was just saying is that um, maybe in the next episode, what we'll do is we'll head towards um, Blackwater, where uh, they're kind of scoping for. Um, Sean, because I know that's towards the area of where I want to try to look for the type of horse that I want, so, um, we'll see if we can head that direction, find the horse I want, and then go, go do that mission, and we'll, uh, Good job. sell or get rid of this horse. Getting late. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Well, then, you get a set up. Still kind of... Just games trying to teach me how to do everything. Still, uh, I've finished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <gasps> yeah, I don't have any. It doesn't matter, but don't have any ingredients at all. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. I wonder if I can just cook them all so I've got them. If it's going to make me stop at some point. I had six of them, I think. And I think, um, oh, that's a decision I have to make. Um, so there's a horse in this game called the Missouri Foxtrotter that's a pretty rare breed of horse like you don't they're not in the wild um, and you can't actually purchase one until like chapter six like you know close to the very end of the game um, and there's actually kind of like a little glitch or exploit you can do at the end of this mission and I'm wondering if I want to do it but I don't I don't think I will I don't really care to he better be worried have that horse, problem. so I'm not gonna worry about it. But what you do is when it asks, when after you you know do this encounter with this bear, Jose asks you if you want to ride back to camp with him or if you want to stay. And if you ride back to camp and then kind of make your way back here, there's a you ready? There's like a random encounter that happens with a um, stranger sure. that's horse has died, 
but occasionally that stranger's horse, if you just keep, you know, saving so, before it and then riding to where it is, and then, you know, well, reloading we'll if the horse is dead, them. sometimes the horse will we be alive. And it's a uh, like silver a dapple pinto Missouri Foxtrotter. But, um, bait then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. Like I said, I, I don't really care for it, so I'm, I don't think I'm going to do it. Chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, Holy we can start right off there. after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. Can I make split, split points yet? No. You have to, like, buy the, up in the pamphlet to be able to do that? I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Okay, I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Pack up, Arthur. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and just. I wonder if you can even save during a mission. Yeah, I know you can't. Um. Let's go. Crap. I was like, maybe I'll save just in case I do ever want that we'll horse, it but down by the water. That's eh, where I, saw him last. I don't think I do, so okay. we're okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the life? Uh, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. There's uh, Hamish's the is, house. There's never really any getting out and staying in. I wonder if Buell is hard. You know that. in the back. But Bessie no. and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Oh, but what I was going to say before... Um, oh my goodness, come on. Um, before I start talking about that horse, is that um, I think you can so you can ride back with Jose, or you can stay, Look and you can actually go and hunt the bear. Bones. Any sign of him? I think I want to stay this time and see if I can well, actually kill the bear. He sure look big enough. But I'll probably just end up dying, uh, to be honest. This way. My last playthrough, I didn't hunt trees. hardly any of the legendary animals. I think I killed like the buck because you get a trinket that kind of helps with hunting. Um, the wolf and like the coyote. Like I, I honestly haven't done any of it because I, I just feel bad. Like it's just kind of sad that once when you, you know, kill the animal, that's. That's it, and it's you know no more. Half eaten fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Something else on the ground, just Jose is just right behind me, yeah. Take a look then. I stand up, will he stand up? Just standing in it. Let's keep going. Good job, Jose. Damn it. Looks like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. A, a little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we. 
Split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work. Which you think? Last time I put the bait, so I'm gonna try what this does. Let's split up. Okay. I'll head this way. You head down that track. So he's going the way the bear is. Maybe it, I don't know, maybe it, it switches where its position is and it's up here now. Oh, Hosea. <laughs> yeah, it just so. <laughs> He's just running from it. I don't know. Are you alright? You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. It's nothing at all. Thank you. I think that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well, so I'm gonna stay. Coming? I don't know if it'll actually let me well, hunt the bear, but here for a while. we'll try. <laughs> uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah. Crap! Do I? Did he give me the rolling block rifle or whatever rifle that was? Because if not, I'm going to be screwed with this thing. Yeah, it looks like I can keep tracking it. Might as well grab it all. Oh wow, this thing's super dirty. My only question is is that um, we don't um, I haven't been told about the trapper yet so I wonder if it'll just kind of throw it on my map or because I feel like the last time that the trapper showed up it was just kind of like someone made like a passing comment in camp about a trapper and then it just like put it on my map so I wonder if that's the case or if I just go to where he's at it'll you know he'll be there here we are looks a way off well, let's see if we can see if we can find this guy. Getting close. There he is. He's so big. Please die. Oh crap, oh crap. Please die. Oh. Oh yeah, up in the corner there. See, so just added the trapper. Cool. Let's uh let's skin him, throw him on the horse, then maybe we'll call it an episode in the next episode. I know that the trapper is again in the general direction of where I wanna go for um the horse I wanna get as well as the mission for Sean, so we can turn this in while we're over there. So 
sweet. You know what? Actually, we'll uh, we'll make this one a little bit longer. Let's actually um, just ride back to camp. Legendary burrito, grizzly bear. I'm curious. The legendary burrito is endemic to Okray's run in the Grizzly East. The bear is larger than any other that has been spotted in the region. The distinct scars across its face and body make this creature easily identifiable as an omnivore. Its diet ranges from berries, roots, and grasses, deer, elk, fish, and car carrion. Um, Long-range weapons like a scope rifle or bow. Da -da -da. Killing this animal will give you an opportunity to craft rare talisman. Cool. Well, that's the bear done. Uh... So it does kind of make me, I guess, a little bit sad that I, you know, I'm gonna miss out on a, you know, an opportunity to get a Missouri Fox Trotter. But to be honest, in my last playthrough that I got, you know, like halfway through, and then as well as online, I've never ridden a, I've never ridden one before. But I, I mean, I don't really care all that much about that, so. Waypoint back to camp. Oh, so the trapper that I was thinking of is if that's Wallace's station. It's like in this area, there's the mission for Sean, and then the place that I want to go to look for the horses. Kind of like right here, I think. Um, but what I noticed was that the trapper, it didn't put the trapper where I thought it would be, it put the trapper that's right here. So maybe we just ride to him to turn in the carcass and then call it an episode. The next episode, we'll uh, ride back to camp. Um, I want to ride back to camp because I want to grab my Tennessee Walker that should yeah. should be at camp. I hope, um, and then we can have this one follow us. And sell this one. What's that noise? Is a wolf swimming in the water? Let's go. <laughs> there, boy. to the trap or two just to get some money but let's keep going what's so hard about this game is you know even if I set a waypoint to try to get somewhere that's pretty close there could be you know three or four random events or you know different encounters like that that happen that just gets me sidetracked and make a short little ride last 10 minutes or 15 minutes so I haven't seen the random encounter for that Apple Pinto. See what I'm saying? Random encounter, but we'll see what he's going to get. Because a lot of the times it might be like a cougar or a bear and it ends up killing him. Hey, so. careful how you go. Can't you see I'm tracking game here? What's just that? It's just a Morgan, but it won't let me see. Sounds like a bear. Saw you over there. It freaking is a bear. Oh crap. So I can turn in his pelt as well, but I know his horse is gonna run, so I need to Did I save him? Oh no he died. Crap. 
but this guy got me an extra bear pelt as long as his horse doesn't take off here. I can throw this pelt on the back of his horse and have my horse follow me and sell them both to the trapper. I doubt it's perfect because with how many shot times I shot it. Let's see what it says. Probably poor. Yeah, poor. Oh, it's a Morgan. Alright, no more freaking stopping here. This episode's going to turn into like 45 minutes. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to do that because if I bond with that horse too much, if I do have a temporary horse, it's going to make it disappear. Crap, how far am I? Okay, that's... Well, going to make it last even longer. That's walking distance, but... Here we go. This is... You know what? It's a... It's a poor pelt. It's not even... It's not even worth it. Now I'm all worried that I, doing that, made my Tennessee Walker disappear, but we'll find out. Have I been given... I haven't. When do I get... Oh, you know what? I think I, during... This is something that I know nothing about. I've seen, you know, trees that look like numbers along this trail, but I, I have no idea the significance of it or where it goes or anything like that. So, I if there's another one, I think right at this bend, there's one. Yeah. Doesn't really look like a number though, so I don't know. It, but I was like, is Arthur gonna write in his journal or? Yep. yep. Go. Yep. Yep. Hi there. Don't believe we've met before. All right, let's have a look. Sixty bucks, dang. Done. Thanks for But help. I use that to all made. I have to pay him for the clothes anyway, but. Get. Oh, I, I can just get the bear hat if I want to. I don't. I don't know if I want it right now. It's a nice coat, though. Cool. Well, I think that's where we're gonna leave it off for this one. Um, thanks so much for watching, and I'll. Catch everyone in the next one.